No Film School's coverage of Cinegear 2019 is brought to you by Black Magic Design, creating revolutionary solutions for film, post-production, and television. And Firefly, unlimited music and non-GMO hosting. The fact that I have this like Roman shoulder pad, I have this gladiatorial, is what it feels like. I, feel, I actually really do feel invincible. We are back at Ergo Rig. We saw them first at NAV. Shout out to our good buddy, director, DP friend, Daniel Gomez, for turning us on. And I'm here again with Jesse. How's it going, brother? Good, man. How are you? I got to tell you, not only do I feel like a Roman gladiator with this thing on, but apparently these things have been doing pretty cool. There's been a lot of buzz about them in my little circle. So how's everything been from you since we talked to NAV? Uh, it's been pretty great. You know, all the, all the No Film School users were, were super awesome, you know, giving us a lot of attention. We've had a lot of high-profile filmmakers that that I'm not gonna mention by name but make me super excited that they're using it yeah so everybody's using it uh, huge features uh, Discovery Channel stuff doc stuff uh, commercials it's it's works for any camera so it's getting out there so just for a refresher for our viewers will you explain to us what the ergo rig is and what kind of separates it from other sort of, of rig systems that we've seen Sure, so the whole idea behind the ergo rig is to allow you to operate just as if the camera's on your shoulder. So this pad mimics your shoulder, you just don't have the weight on your shoulder. So you can literally float it, you know, inches above if you need to be a little taller, or just right above your shoulder. So you can handheld like normal, you just don't have the weight. So at the end of the day, you can do your normal life things. In fact, behind I see that there's a little ergo rig demonstration. Now this is something I didn't see when, when Daniel did it. So what's this, this uh, cable for right here? So it's a prototype of a new underslung system okay. uh, that's not available for release yet. We literally showed it to people for the first time yesterday. Uh, it's going to be an add-on to existing rigs. Uh, all the Everything's ready. If you have a rig already, you can just add it on. Uh, so is it like a plate that I, that I just screw in somewhere here? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. And, it, and it's going to be a way to allow you to do underslung in an elegant, nice way. The, the strap has some elasticity to it, so it does take out a little bit of your steps. Um, it's still handheld. We're not trying to do anything except for handheld. We're just trying to protect the operator. But the weight transfer system works the same way as with it on your shoulder. If, if, you, if you don't want to deal with this and you're, you're in more of a dock situation, you can just have a strap on the top of your camera. So I, what has been the feedback from filmmakers that you've been getting? Obviously a lot of guys are really, really excited about this. Yeah, I, I've put it on a lot of people now, and there's this, this amazing face they have often when I put a heavy camera on them that they just don't get it. Like, it's, it, they, they know there's a camera on them, but they don't feel the camera. Oh, I like the rig. It's comfortable. It's balanced nicely. Yeah, this is good. Have you tried this? It definitely takes all the weight And it's light. That feels good. This feels great. All the weight is down here. If you use my photo, I have the legend, which is oh, cool. I'm old, I'm weak. <laughs> that's that's a, Yeah, I don't want to say the word. I don't want to say game changer. I don't like saying that word, but it is huge. Our cameras are getting, if they feel heavier and heavier, there's always new bells and whistles. What's kind of the maximum camera load I'm still gonna wanna put on this before I'm gonna go, okay guys, maybe we should maybe we should just put it on something a little bit different. It's up to what you want to let people know you can carry. The rig will take it. Uh -huh. You know, we, we've, we've had a 65 with anamorphics on it, no trouble. It's whatever you're willing to carry. If you wanna do handheld with a, a long zoom lens, that's up to you, but the rig will take it. So the rig will, the rig will let me become the decider of my own fate. Exactly. So once again, what's the price point for the Ergo Rig as I see it, and what is the price point going to be for the for the undersling attachment? Uh, Ergo Rigs are eighteen fifty, available at ergorig.com now. Mm -hmm. The attachment is a little bit of a TBD thing. Okay. Yeah. And do you have any idea when that will be announced? Uh, also TBD, but not that long in the future.